Okay, hello everyone, uh, welcome to the stream. Uh, and this is going to be a very short stream, uh, it's going to be like one hour. And uh, I just want to get the plugs working. <laughs> That's basically the primary goal of this. And I think I can do it in one hour if, if you know, everything goes to plan. Okay, let me just uh, get ready and uh, I will begin. All right, so, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go and start. So, uh, welcome to the stream, as I said, this is the 31st stream of the Space Station game. Um, everything is fine. Um, and on the last stream, I spent two hours just abstracting my connection network so that I can do iConnectable and connection network and I did not start with Visual Studio, sorry. Um, only to be, uh, <laughs> only to realize that actually uh, I only saved like 100 lines of code, right? And I, I even realized today that um, maybe I'm not even ever going to re reuse the iConnectable because what I was thinking about yesterday was reusing iConnectable thing, abstracting connections so that I can take, um, so I, I can, for example, reuse it for uh, valves or something like that um, for, uh, you know, pressure system. But the thing is that in the pressure system, I'm not only going to have one connectable connecting to other connections, right? I am actually going to have a pressure vessel which connects to valves and then valves connect to other pressure vessel so it's like it is a little bit different right it's not I won't be able to just exactly use it but we have what we have um, so yeah today I just want to make it work so yeah this is this is what I got working yesterday and hopefully this works let's see let me just All right, here we go. I'm charging the phone. Yeah, it is. Okay, sorry. Uh, so yeah, there we, there we go. This is the electrical network. Uh, what I can do is I can click on switches and I can turn on the things. Okay, everything works, that's good. And as you, um, yeah, these are batteries that get depleted. Uh, so yeah, if you turn on, connect the batteries, they're going to be depleted. But this here, yeah, and once they're exhausted, they, they disappear. Uh, they, <laughs> these, these are consumers that use up all the power. And this is the infinite power source. So if I turn on this power source, it is actually going to turn on the, the lights, but it's also going to charge the batteries. If I... Uh, disconnect the lights is going to uh, charge the batteries much faster. So, you know, a very basic kind of uh, electric system uh, just for use in this game. So, let's get it working with plugs, right? And what plugs am I talking about? Well, I, if I go into my main scene, I can show you that I have some plugs. Oh no! <laughs> Uh, what the hell? Error while loading the main 
Ooh, oof, oof, oof. This sucks. Okay. Uh, shit. So last night, parse error. Fail loading resource main. Make sure resources have been imported. Okay, let me actually restart. Uh, so what happened yesterday was I actually uh, merged. Uh, I moved the uh, branches around in my git and so hopefully it's going to work okay <laughs> maybe something got disconnected and it requires a restart uh, okay well this is this is one of the problems with uh, Godot sometimes no fuck okay well this ends the stream <laughs> Now I'm going to spend another hour trying to figure out what's what's up here. Okay, why doesn't it work? Why doesn't it work? I was just... Yeah, uh, something... The, the scene obviously got corrupted. Well, yeah, another reason why not to use Godot. Uh, 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 what what was this test, test thing which I used for... Uh, test player movement. Let's see. Oh my god, not even this works. What the fuck? Okay, everything is corrupted now. Great. Great. And of course, nothing has... Nothing has really changed. Because I've just moved... I've just moved the branches around. That's all I did. Alright. So... Well, here is what I'm going to try to do. Uh, I'm going to delete the cache and hopefully it's going to rebuild. Uh, no, not here. Uh, Godot. Uh, it should be... What is it? Godot. Uh, Godot, this one. Exported, imported. Okay, let's try to remove the entire thing. I should have probably <laughs> moved it or packed it. Hmm? Did it refuse to to? Oh, it's because probably of the because I I have my Visual Studio on. Oh yeah, and and it completely broke. How are you? Well, I'm feeling terrible because Godot decided to not work. Okay, let's see. Let's see if it's going to rebuild everything. Some extensions need to restart. Okay, let's see. Is it going to restart on its own or do I need to start it? Huh? <laughs> uh, looks like I need to restart it. Myself. Okay. It did say restart. It didn't say quit and restart. Okay, there it is. It's it's loading everything. Okay, let's wait for all the assets to be reimported. Great, great, and I don't have much time. Forty-five minutes to go. Why did it stop at this thing? What the fuck? <laughs> Come on. Hello, low ether. 
Oh my god. I wasn't expecting I wasn't expecting to have to rebuild. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe it's just broken now. Cool. So maybe this is the the end of the Godot project. You know, I'm just so frustrated from all the bugs. I don't know. I don't know. It's uh, probably got stuck. And it crashed. I didn't even do anything. It just crashed on its own. Cool. And uh, now I, I wonder if everything is going to be corrupted or not. Did it create a good dough? It did. Okay, now it's stuck at this. So I, I, am I going to have to rest... Uh, is it going to crash for every texture? That's terrible and it's hard to understand what's going on with Godot. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Why did all the scenes get corrupted when I just moved when I just moved branches? That's all I did. Uh, I didn't even change the files at all, right? I just I just moved to the master. I I merged a branch into master that I was on, so there was no difference at all. <laughs> There was no difference at all, and it's just decided that, yeah, the scenes are corrupted. Come on, I'm just waiting for it, for it to crash. Okay, now. Uh... Now I regret for deleting that the, the entire folder. <sighs> what? I've never seen this end process dialogue before. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Can you word it? No, because I actually deleted this uh, the cache folder and it doesn't even want to rebuild the cache. That's the problem. That's the problem. I, I, I deleted the dot Godot folder, right? Which is not even which is not even in Git. So yeah, there's nothing I can do now. There's absolutely nothing I can do now except try to delete it again and hope. Yeah, looks like it's completely broken now. Looks like it's completely broken. Great, don't you love this? So it doesn't even want to rebuild. <laughs> it doesn't even want to rebuild the, the library folder. Well, it's called library in... Okay, I'm going to do it again. I'm going to try it one more time. 
And, you know, I think this is going to be a... I think this is going to be... How do you call it? The drop that... The, the straw that breaks the camel's back. That's what I mean. Right? What's the... The only change is the stream. And... Yeah. My laptop. That's the same branch that I was on yesterday. I just merged it with, into master. That's it. There's not. There's no difference. There's no difference. So... Yeah, great. <laughs> I think this is it. Some extension need editor to restart. And now if I restart, it's going to just shut down and not even restart. Oh, there it is. It actually restarted. But is it going to crash? <laughs> Last time it didn't want to restart. Okay, there it is. And it is. it has got... It's. it's oh, okay, there it is. It is going on. Okay, please. What the fuck? Why does it stop at this hotspot? It's it should be called hotspot, not hot post. So yeah, there's some kind of a bug with uh, reading textures or something. Level of personal frustration. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so there's one more hope. Uh, I'm gonna just try this, and then I'm just gonna abandon Godot completely. I think. Because I don't have patience to deal with Godot bugs anymore. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried. I tried. I tried. Um, I tried. Uh, yeah, I want to actually try to do... Uh, okay, let's try to download the latest beta. And, and let's see if that actually fixes anything. Because basically the... The 4.2 is almost complete. It's almost complete. Uh, I think the one that I have is 4.1.3, right? Is it? It doesn't see it. Aha, uh, there it is. 4.1.2. Oh, there is actually 0.3. Okay, let's try. Let's try doing a point. Okay, yeah, this is broken. This is broken. Come on, crash. Crash, please. Crash, please. There it is. End process. Thank you. Uh, okay, I'm just going to download 1.3. Uh, but yeah, I need the net version. <sighs> okay, okay, let's see. Let's find the install. I'm going to delete the, the project again. Uh, install Godot, 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 Godot. Where did I actually have Godot? Okay, there it is. 4.1.2. I was thinking of trying the 4.2, but yeah. Let's not play with non stable versions. Okay, so this is a newer version now. Uh, let's put it here. <laughs> okay like this 4.1 wait wait what is this this is a console I actually copied the long, wrong thing it should be this one good thing I noticed this little icon okay so let's hope that for wait a minute why does it say 4.1 uh, did I wait Am I blind? 4.3. Oh, this is 4.3. Okay. <laughs> this is 4.1.3. And does it say version? Yeah, 4.1.3. Yeah, it's good. Okay, let's let's load this. 
crossing fingers crash please <laughs> yeah it's uh it's uh it's like you want godot to crash you know you don't want it to work Please confirm. Okay, let's restart. Oh, oh, there was something that it just decided not to do anything about. Okay, let's see if those textures load up again. If they fix the issue in 4.1.3. If not, okay, there are the textures being loaded. And, and, and I think it's, oh, 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 it loaded. Did it work? Did it work? Uh, it doesn't, it doesn't want to work anymore. Okay, not responding. Nice. I like this little, uh, little editor. Look how tiny it is. <laughs> so the, uh, the loading thing disappeared, but I can't tell if this is working or not now. Jesus. Wide screen, yeah, ultra, ultra wide. Extremely wide. Okay, so I guess it's broken again. I have no idea if I should just wait for it to, to complete whatever it is trying to complete. I, I doubt. You know, I don't even have a, a lot of assets. The only thing that is actually heavy in the whole project is that EXR of the background, which is like 35 megabytes. And that's the only heavy thing in the, in the entire game. Everything is pretty light. So I have no idea what what is going on here obviously it's trying to import these there it is 8k earth mask probably this is the this is the thing that it's failing at but is it moving is there more things being generated i don't think so okay you found some issue you found some issues. I have to go to GitHub now. Reimporting assets crashes. Just confirming this is happening. That happens to me too. Well, whatever. Uh, what what does it mean? Still reproduce it. Pfft. Not planned. What is going on here? I don't know. All right, all right, I have no idea. I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea now what's going on. Restart computer. Uh, that doesn't, that won't do anything, I mean, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Hey, wait. It did that. Did this? I think this one was actually added. Oh my god, fuck. Fuck. It was actually doing something, I think. <laughs> Let's try to, to uncrash. Okay, maybe it was still actually working, doing something, and I interrupted it. But for some reason, the, 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 the loader here, the progress bar failed. Yeah, 43 megabytes for Earth day map. Uh, I mean, that's an 8K texture, so. So it's doing something. I don't know what the CTEX file is. I guess it's uh maybe it's uncompressed texture or something. Okay, and now it even failed. Aha, there it is. Star map EXR. It's working on the star map. 
So I think that's the only other heavy thing. Uh, you know, maybe it's gonna unpack the star map now. But yeah, maybe the problem is that the uh, you know it occupies all of the processing power, so it doesn't actually update the the, the progress bar. But looks like it's doing something. There is some kind of a temporary here. Why for can? <laughs> well, actually, because well, because you are in low Earth orbit. And it is still PS1, but <laughs> uh, when you're looking at the Earth, uh, the Earth texture, even if it's like 4K, it looks the pixels look gigantic. So yeah, and the star map as well. The star map, and the problem is that uh, well, the star map is used for the background, of course, for the like the skybox. And the thing is that. The problem here is that the star map is um, AXR because it has deep, uh, like, um, it has different um, exposure. Because some stars are really bright, some and, and some background things are very dim. So that's the biggest thing. Okay, let's see if the, it has done anything. No. Okay, so I don't know. I have no idea even if it's processing anything or not. Maybe I should try, like, I'm thinking, I was thinking the other day to, to try the beta and, and try if it even works, if it even loads anything. Uh, does it have a download archive? 4.2 yeah beta 6 it's 13 november it's two days ago uh and they did actually have a post snapshot and they say that the stable release is drawing near but they still have fixes number of show stopper yeah there's got to be, yeah, I don't know. I have a feeling like this is going to be a lot even, even more buggy. Hey, there it is. It has completed. Okay. <laughs> okay. So it just it was just actually it was working. It was working. Uh, okay, well, maybe this is not the straw that broke the camel's back, after all. So, it seems to be working, it just was not showing me that it was updating. Uh, oh yeah, it is this one, okay. So, let's see if anything has changed uh, when it comes to... Well, yeah, I, now I don't really have time to work on, on the game. <laughs> because I have like 25 minutes remaining okay let's see if there's any changes to the version or something yeah aha yeah it did actually update the version and the main did change but i don't see what's the difference maybe there's no difference okay let's see if it even works Hmm, yeah, nice. Nice sound buffers uh, overflowing, yeah. <laughs> okay, so yeah, there it is. It works. It still works. It's still the game. Uh, I guess the... Uh, it, still, it still manages to not frustrate me enough. <laughs> uh, and the... Okay, the verlate ropes don't work. That's great. Uh, so there's something wrong there, obviously. Obviously there's something wrong. Uh, okay, let me now try restarting so that it may be, maybe it just needed to compile the scripts, you know, because this, this happens sometimes. And uh, I am going to... Rev well, does it did it change anything? I don't think so. Oh, it did change, but it says... 
Ah, too large to display. Yeah, I think that probably what changed was that it fucked up the every. <laughs> it fucked up everything. So I'm going to actually discard. The problem is that in Godot you need to like. Okay, uh, it doesn't allow me to discard. Uh, unstage. I guess I need to unstage and then discard. Okay. Um, yeah, the problem is that in Godot. Uh, the scripts get only compiled after you launch it once. So what happened because I loaded a uh, because I loaded the game, the project with uncompiled scripts, it failed. It did it. it all the references were fucked. So I, I, that is what I'm guessing the problem is. Okay, uh, using UI paths that's normal. There's something else edited scene. Out of bounds, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's see if it has made any changes automatically. No, it hasn't. Okay, let's try launching now. Ah, there they are. Here are the ropes. They work. Cool. Okay. It's good that I at least I realized what the problem is. <laughs> uh, yeah, there it is. It works. Okay, good. Uh, it's good that I deduced what the problem was. Okay. Uh, yeah, otherwise I would be frustrated even more. Uh, but you kind of learn to live with the frustrations, I guess. <laughs> okay, does plugging in work? So yeah, basically what I'm trying to tell you here, well, what I was trying to tell you uh, 40 minutes ago uh, is that I have these plugs and I can plug them in, which doesn't work. Uh, damn it. Okay, let's see. Does it work? Does it work? What's, uh, what's going on? Oh, and it crashed. No, it didn't crash. No, there it is. Okay, it does work. But for some reason it... Uh, there was a freeze. There was a freeze. Maybe it was compiling shaders or something. Great. Uh, yeah, there it is. You can plug things in. But right now it doesn't use electrics, so that is what I'm. That is what I want to do. I want to make the plugs use electrics, but I'm not going to do it in main. I'm going to do in another. I'm going to try to do something today because, well, I don't really have time. Uh, but at least this works. Okay, I'm gonna go into test player movement because in this in this test, first it's much easier, it's much uh, faster to load, and I already have the plugs and everything here working. So I feel like I'm watching a scary streaming. Yeah, exactly. It's a horror movie. It's a horror stream. You never know what what's gonna fail next. You know. Okay, there it is. Uh, so yeah, in this scene I am actually like debugging. I can debug. Okay, so what I actually do want to do is I want to combine these electrics and the plugs. So let's uh, let me add an electrical node into this plug. Uh, we could even use this as a plug, but no, I can't because it needs to be a node. It needs to be a node. So node 3D. I'm going to add it as a uh, as a quick load. It's going to be electrical node, electrical node, and I'm going to call it E node. Uh, so what happens now is that when I plug into the socket, ah, I even have a slot. Yeah, the slot. So when I slot, this is what's going to happen. I should actually, uh, yeah, the slot should find the electrical node. Maybe then it should be a child of the slot or something. 
The problem is that I will have to make it all into editable children. Yes, beautiful. We all love editable children. Uh, well, maybe I shouldn't make it into editable children. Instead, I should just put it next to next to it. Uh, let's see. Let's see the plug. How does the plug work? Uh, yeah, maybe I should not add it to the to the prefab uh, as an e node. Okay. Don't save. Okay, I'm just gonna add it here as a child and I'm gonna call it enode that's gonna be a electrical plug electrical node all right and well I need to duplicate it so that it would show oh no it does actually work it does actually show okay enode I'm just gonna call it enode what why does it let me Oh, because this e node has been saved. Okay, let's not do this. Uh, okay. Yeah, instead, I'm going to make this the e node. So. Yeah, now it needs to connect to something. It's to connect to something. Yeah, let's go to the plug. Plug, 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 plug. Ah, yeah, how do I even know what is going to be plugged? That's another problem. That's another question. Where's my plug? Interaction slot. Oh, it's actually slot, not the plug. So when I slot, ah, right, the slot doesn't actually do anything. Uh, it's, it's all in the slotable. Slottable, yeah, there it is. Okay, so how do I make this slottable work? <laughs> work with the plug. So find slot, I can slot, I can try slot, and I can slot two. So in this slot two, I'm gonna have to do some kind of finding the electrical nodes. If child of the slot, or a sibling is an electrical node. Maybe I can actually reference it inside the slot. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to make this editable children. Yeah, that sucks because there's going to be so many things inside it and then I won't be able to connect. God damn it. Godot is, has so many limitations with this. Uh, why, why did they have to make it so complicated? How good is C-Sharp in Godot? Well, it's good until it, it, uh, it, it just <laughs> fails. Um... The problem is if I make this editable children and it has an E node, yeah, I'm going to have to find it automatically. Uh, but it won't work with an. Connectable. I am definitely going to have to have a connectable. The problem is that this slotable is actually, uh, yeah, it can slot anything. So maybe I need to inherit the slotable with my own type. But then inheritance doesn't work in Godot <laughs> because you can't put multiple base classes in an array. Oh. It seems you're having a hard time. Yes, I am having a hard time because 
anything you want to, any kind of more complex architecture you want to have in Godot breaks down because it's, uh, Godot doesn't support so many things. Uh, so many things that in Unity I would be like, yeah, this is how you do it. Yeah, I just don't even think about it. Yeah, so if you want to have things that are abstract and have different ways of interacting with things and work with different things, <laughs> suddenly you get into these architectural problems. So I don't know even how to solve this. So when I plug, I'm definitely going to... Well, I can have... I can reference an electrical node here, but the, that, the thing is that the slottable is not exclusively an electrical plug it can be anything it can be any i connectable okay i'm just going to call this connectable Okay, and then I'm going to keep a reference to I connectable. Connectable. Okay, let's call it connectable. Okay, and then I'm going to check if... Do I have a ready here? Ready, yes. I'm going to be like connectable if... Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, find... how How is it? Uh, find node. Get node. Get nodes. Oh shit, I need to get a parent. Get parent. Get parent dot get node. Um, connectable, right? Yeah, this is gonna be get node, get node or null. Okay, uh, connectable node, right? And then I say if, if connectable node is I connectable. Oh, well, I can actually do this. Connectable is if collect. Okay, I need to do it like this. It's not null. Then connectable is connectable node as I connectable, right? Something like this. Can this be simplified? No, I don't think it can. C sharp doesn't give me any advice okay and let's find and uh, let's me just add a gd print here gd print found connectable so i have a connectable here and it should be able to find connectable on the start so let's see All right, does it say anything? I don't understand why there is this freeze between it starts outputting things. It's just some weird uh, Godot thing. Okay, it did not work. <laughs> Great, it doesn't output anything. So, it did not find it. It did not find a connectable node. Why? Why did it not find a connectable node, right? It's it's in here. It's a plug. This is the slot. No, not the plug, the slot. This is the slot. The slot takes the parent and then takes the child of the parent and tries to get connectable. What the fuck? Right? Connectable is the name. Connectable is the name. Let's try to... Um, let's try to make editable children. Yeah, there it is. This is the slot. It goes up and then it goes down to find connectable.
Restart computer, yes. Come on. Come on. Come on, wake up, good dough, and give me... Okay, there it is. Inited and nothing. Cool. Cool. Now I have to debug this. Uh... Pfft. Is it that I'm not getting a child correctly? Get first child. Okay, is this actually going to work? I wonder. Okay, let me rewrite this. I don't know why this doesn't work. Does it need this or something? I don't know. I think that this is a relative relative to the parent, right? Is there like get sibling or something? No, there is no get sibling. This should work, so I don't know why it's not working. Anyway, let's try it in a different way. Okay, let's try to do just connectable. Is get parent, get first child i connectable so this is my own um oh it cannot be used yeah can't be used because it's not a node <laughs> great uh yeah i don't know i don't know i guess <sighs> this should work because i'm already using the get child Get node, get node in other things like here. Get parent or null. Um, player movement button. Get first child, get node or null. Here. I'm definitely getting these with get node. Get node or null. Can I actually do I connectable? I can. Okay, let's try to do this connectable. If connectable is not null. Why does every little single uh, simple thing in Godot just not work as you as you would think? Oh my God! Okay, I, I okay. This is my problem. Okay, this is my problem. I made a mistake. I made a big mistake. This should not be a slotable. This should happen in a slot. <laughs> okay, my bad. My bad. Uh, I may I confuse the two different yeah this should be inside the s fuck now now it now it's my fault okay not Godot's fault not Godot's fault I'm sorry I I made a mistake <laughs> okay it should be actually in the slot not in the slotable Why not get children? Well, get child is by an index, so that's not not good. There it is. Found connectable. It okay. It does work. It does work. But I have like five minutes left, and I have to go, which is great. Uh, okay, let's try to. Connect this connectable. Okay, let's not have editable children. Let's put let's combine this with some kind of a generic consumer. Okay, I'm just gonna do a node 3D. This is gonna be a uh, electrical node. Electrical node. Uh, 
And I don't know why it, does, it never shows the debug draw once you put it on. So I'm just going to put it here. Uh, and behind, and this is going to connect to this one. So I'm going to have a connections. I'm going to add an element. I'm going to add this one. OK, and then in this one, I'm going to reference the same one. Uh, oh, wait, in this one, I'm going to reference this. OK, there we go. And uh, this thing is going to have another. Yeah, let's let's call it a consumer or something. Consumer. Uh, where is it? Yeah, now I can select it because Godot. I have to find it. I have to find it by name. Uh, there it is. OK, I'm going to add a what is what was this oh yeah no do i does it work automatically when you turn on consumption no i think I, what's the name of it what's the name of it it's something i think it will use a normal node and light electrical light is it this one no it's not electrical light it's a uh, consumer or something like that power consumer uh no, it needs to be a no 3D. OK, let me actually I have to remember test uh, test electrical connections. What is this? What is this orb? What is the orb fake light? It's a power consumer. It is a power consumer. OK, but it needs to be a no 3D. So I'm going to do a this is connectable, right? Connectable to. Uh, yeah, let's call it E node. And this is going to be a, another, th this is going to be light. No, it's going to be cons power consumer. Okay. And a power consumer is going to have the E node. And of course, I need to make a duplicate because debug draw doesn't work when you spawn a thing. Okay. So this thing should become green when I plug it in, right? And on this side, on the other side, I have a plug. Uh, the plug is going to have, should have the tether, right? Okay, let me add a child to the tether. I'm going to uh, make this the contact again. E node, electrical nodes, and make a duplicate so that the gizmos will work. Uh, and I'm going to add one for the plug. So on the plug, I'm going to add another plug E node. And this is going to be plug root E node. OK, and I'm going to connect these two. Uh, actually, I can just copy it like this. Plug E node. And uh, I'm going to kill the transform. Uh, and let's put it somewhere here. OK, let's let me connect this one. There we go. I'm going to connect. No, not that. I'm going to connect this one. Right? Yes, this one. Uh, OK, there we go. We have a two wires. Well, it's hard to see because it's very bright. But there are plugs. There are wires between the root and the plug and between the socket and the light, the, the kind of the, the ab abstract consumer. You need to apologize to Godot. Yes, I need to write an apology letter. OK, so what I want to do is when I plug, it should plug this one to this one, right? So the plug should also look for a connectable. So it should work in both. Actually, I, sh I, I didn't need to remove this. <laughs> uh, does this even work? Connectable? Uh, yeah. 
Maybe I can make it into like a Okay, anyway, so I found a connectable on the plug, right? And I need to say, uh, when I slot, right, I go like, oh yeah, I, this needs to be public, actually. This needs to be public. Uh, well, and I'm gonna make this public as well. No, maybe I don't need to does it really better but I wish everything was just public and c-sharp okay connectable connectable I should be going right now but let's me just implement this connectable um, connect to oh yeah if connectable is not null um, then connectable dot connect to oh yeah connectable is not null and slot is this disconnect no this is not disconnect slotted into uh yeah and slot dot uh or should i use slotted into dot connectable is not null then i'm going to connect to slotted to connectable and I'm gonna do the same thing, but the opposite thing, right? When disconnecting, if uh, slotted into, oh well, I should do it before. If connectable exists, if connectable is not null, and slotted into connectable is not null, then I'm gonna connectable uh, disconnect from from slot can oops slotted into connectable there it is okay so uh, hopefully this is gonna work let's see let's see if they connect okay and one more thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a power source here so this node is going to be a is going to have negative consumption let's put it minus 10 which means that it's a generator so this generates power uh, so let's see okay started um, plug inode wait uh, no this needs to be called connectable connectable yes okay and let's see hopefully it works Okay, so, uh, well, it doesn't work because this should be green. <laughs> uh, great, great. Why doesn't this work now? Okay, this is, this is some, my problem. Okay, let's see, let's see if, if this is going to work. So if I plug this, oh my god, it's not actually... It doesn't, I, I, th I thought the, 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 the wires actually draw, whoops. I thought I actually would draw. Well, fuck. Okay, I thought they would draw in the. Uh, you know, uh, they are actually opaque, but I want to make them draw on top. Anyway, okay. So there is a bug. There is some kind of bugs going on. What does it say? It says, object reference not set to an instance of an object. I connectable seventy. I connectable seventy. What, where is my connectable? I connectable 70. Manager. Oh, the manager is missing. Okay. <laughs> the manager is missing. Okay, I need to make uh, nodes. Nodes, that is going to be my manager. Okay electrics manager let's call it like this and 
electrics electrics manager there it is okay so yes this is why it didn't work this is why it didn't turn green probably because it needs to the electrics manager needs to run first yes and there it is it does actually work now <laughs> cool okay yeah the, the wire is green which means it has power and anyway, let's connect to this boom hey it works it works okay so when I disconnect there it is it actually works disconnecting connecting disconnecting connecting the the power is flowing from the power source to the light okay I am glad that it works after struggling with <laughs> after struggling with all the bugs that Godot has well only well not the bug with the you know finding a, a note that was mine that was my problem but you know yeah pretty cool okay plugging to other stuff of course doesn't work but it does work if you plug it here uh, 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 no, that, that, uh, I'm flying away flying away okay let's plug one more time there it is and that's it well thank you for watching I have to run <laughs> the good thing is that it works uh, and now I need to do other stuff um, with this. So basically, on this on this stream, I only managed to make it make plugs work with electrics. Yes, <laughs> after struggling with corrupting scenes. Nice. Create a simple lamp. Yeah, I was I was actually planning to have a little lamp which will light up uh, with the power and uh, also adding a CRT used power so it can be turned on and off and also yeah video connections it should be a, a parallel thing but I was thinking like maybe if I have time but actually I didn't manage to do anything <laughs> except for the first thing okay well I'm glad that I even uh, I, I, I did at least one one thing right I am glad okay so uh, by the way when I come back home I have to I have to run to uh, to the center of the city and when I'm back around 11 I'm going to do another stream I'm gonna do another stream but it's actually not gonna be this there's gonna be a surprise there's gonna be a little surprise 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 stream okay and what is the surprise going to be? Well, there is, there is, uh, four at four in the morning. On the fifteenth of November. Is uh, is uh, an anniversary of something, that happened. Thirty five years ago. Thirty five years ago? Huh? Wait. Uh, did I calculate that correctly? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes I think it is 35 years ago uh, 11 p.m. Serbian yes 11 p.m. Central European time but no at 4 a.m. something happened 35 years ago not a birthday no although my birthday is soon <laughs> but something happened 35 years ago on this day uh, I mean, on tomorrow at 4 a.m. And I'm going to recreate that. I'm going to try to recreate. You can find out. You can try to find out until until 11 p.m. Uh, uh, and I'm going to try to recreate that for my game. Okay. In in a few hours that I have for the for the anniversary. So it's like going to be a special anniversary thing. So go and find out what happened 15th November. 35 years ago okay that's your uh, that's your uh, secret goal <laughs> okay so uh, yeah if you figure it out uh, write on Twitter or, or you know, on my discord okay I have to go now uh, see you see you around 11 p.m. Or, or a little bit later see you bye thanks for being on the on the corrupted scene 
corrupted scene stream. Okay, well, goodbye.